light switches. Okay. What was the boss? The boss was a cute little kitten. You can see at the top where it says uh, combatants were able to defeat the cute little kitten. Strategies take down cute little kitten. Blah, blah, blah. Plan their strategies and they, then I defeat it. It was a cute little kitten. You should be proud. Okay, what was I doing? Oh, I'm getting hungry again. Oh, I gotta go plant stuff. It's only 3 o'clock in the morning. Um, water bottle. I guess I can get more water bottles for the farming purpose of stuff. <laughs> so I'm pretty much one more side street over, so I'm almost there. Probably be my famous last words. Yes. As you get there, you get zoomed or swarmed, whatever. I'm doing okay on storage space. Um, I forgot. Is there any plastic bags in this place? I don't think we have any plastic bags. Oh, I'm supposed to be built. Oh, no, I can't build the front gate. I need a carpentry six for that. Yeah, fair amount of tin cans, it looks like. Ah, uh, there's some garbage bags, three of them. I wish you could make uh, plastic bags out of duct tape. That would be funny. Yeah, I'm looking for plastic bags as we need those to make uh, water collectors. flower. Cookie pot with water, four. So we have four? That can't be right, is it? Oh. Uh -oh. Ooh, made it. Okay, I was going to say, let's hope that's you that's there making that noise. Good. Okay, now I feel safe enough to actually go to use the washroom, so back in a minute. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so I need uh, one more plastic bag. I'm going to go upstairs and check, make sure there's nothing up there. I don't think there was. I think I already went through this stuff, didn't I? Stuff we need. Not be 
resource stuff, really. Yeah, I need a plastic bag. One more. And we don't have it. Garbage bags. And the question is, is it light enough outside to do some farming? Doesn't look like it. Still pretty dark. Too bad though. Okay, so. For. Uh, so basically we have to uh, dig up the ground a little bit. I'm currently growing what potatoes, radishes, and broccoli, I think. Man, that was scary. <laughs> it is, isn't it? <laughs> it's not as bad as I thought it would be. The main, the best part is traveling at night, because that's the really scary part. Ah, uh, don't worry. Or, uh... Oops. Okay, so I'll just dump the stuff in the Do you need assistance? The first crate over here then. Okay. So I got electrical wire. Duct tape. Garden saw. Propane torch. Three boxes of nails. That'll work. Where's the rain when you need it? This is when we gotta. Thirsty, thirsty parch, so. Yeah, I don't think we should use, uh. Tainted water. It's safe for drinking. You shouldn't use it on the plants, right? You think? Hmm? The rain collector bottle. The, the rain collector stuff, can you use that on the plants to water them to keep them going? Does that make sense? I mean, do you have to boil them first before you put them on the plants, is what you're asking? Yeah. No, you don't have to boil it. Okay. Because this is tainted. It's unsafe, it's unsafe for drinking, so I think it would be unsafe for, you know. It's safe for, you can use it for the plant. Okay. You say so. It's going to be a trip inside the house. Thirsty, thirsty, thirsty.
fills them up quick. So that's thirsty, and that's thirsty, and that's more water, and less thirsty. There's a garden hose we didn't get. Oh, that was enough water. Water, enough there. Wow, these little uh, water collectors apparently hold quite a bit of water. Seems like they do at least. That back. Now it's got enough. I think it should be well watered. Almost uh, well fertilized with zombie blood. Okay, well, that's all our seeds and stuff. I don't think we have any more. Oh, we have two uh, radish seeds. Oh, we got another potato seeds packet. Hmm. I sure should do that. Lots of seeds. Oh, we got more broccoli. Uh, yeah. Ugh. Getting hungry? A little hungry, slightly thirsty. No, I have a heavy butt, but the hell am I carrying so heavy? Oh, probably all the water. Duh. And the worms. Missions of this game in new, new game developer are a mix between cartoonish yet hyper realistic movement. Yeah, the game is uh, different. Different. So what would you say, Jeff? More potatoes or more broccoli that we need to grow? What was the other option? Broccoli or potatoes? Hello, potatoes. everyone. Oh, that's what I thought, too. My name is Veronica, and welcome to Gimpy's Twitch channel. If the other option was beets. I if you are beets, enjoying what you are watching, good too. please click the follow button in the lower right corner of the video screen. That way you will be notified by Twitch when Gimpy goes live. You can also follow Gimpy over on Twitter at GimpyNee. He tweets out there when he goes live and will more than likely follow you back. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching, everyone. Happy Friday. We ran out of cabbage. Not cabbage? No, bro, uh, radish seeds. That's what we ran, ran out of. More radishes. There's more water in cans to make this faster, too. So do I have to claim this as a safe house, or how does it work now? Oh, shit. Um, 
go into like the, the kitchen area, hit, I think you right click and choose safe house, I think. And then see what the options are there. So forget. Title, owner, Gimpy, safe opposition, blah, 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 allow players, Jeff and Tottage. That player, respond. Oh, yeah, here it is. This is a little clicky thing. Yep. Respond in safe house. Is it checked? No? No, it wasn't. Okay. Now it is. Yeah, I think you have to do that every time you log in to the server, I think. Well, now we know. Mm hmm. Of course, that'll probably be one of those situations where we'll forget and just about to die and say, Oh shit, get in the house. Claim safe house. No, don't die. Too late. Ah, uh, your garden looks great. We got potatoes and broccoli and radishes. Thirsty. Gonna be thirsty. So let's see, we survived the helicopter thing. You got a wall, you got a gate. Oh, yeah, sort of a gate, yeah. So Got to get... Well, I have to get my... a lot of water collection? Uh, we definitely need more water collection, that's for sure, because it lasts a decent amount, but I don't know how much we're actually going to need, right? So you need how many garbage bags per four water per collector? Four oh, per yeah. collector, yeah. Okay, I could start looking around for... Garbage bags, I guess. Oh, um, wait. I gotta eat a horse first. One sec. I'll go yeah. grab some food. <laughs> gotta eat a horse. Good. I'm here thirsting. Ooh, this cake. Cake? Where did you get cake from? Not anymore. Oh, I'm probably getting thirsty, aren't I? Did Slightly you cook anything thirsty. or there's nothing in the fridge? How do you, there should be stuff in the fridge fridge. Oh there's stuff in the fridge, but nothing Cooked. prepared moves. Oh yeah, nothing prepared now. Ah, oh, just. <laughs> I ate everything I cooked because I'm not the best cook, so. So, watered, watered, fine, not watered. So, everything's watered. Okay, can I dump? Uh, rain collector barrel. Oh, you pull it now. Add water from item. So that's how you transfer stuff over. So this isn't it. So, like I said, eventually you have to, again, collect this stuff, get into bottles, and they're actually not bottles, but into the boiling pots, I think it is. And you gotta, whatever they're called.
Okay, so. No, this is not where I want to be. I want to be downstairs. Throw all our gardening stuff back into storage. Oh, there's a man chop roast in the fridge. Okay. It's not where I had the garden stuff. I think I have the garden stuff in the app store. You keep it, so worms, seeds. Oh, I've got lots of potato seeds, though. Oh, we okay, so many. Oh, that's right. I didn't use up all the broccoli seeds. And the water again. There, too. Got to remember to fill up uh, other containers full of water as much as we can before the water goes off. Too. I don't know how much longer we have. It's going to be probably a while. not much longer. It should be a while still because it, it doesn't go off that quickly. Okay, so water bottles. Hey, buddy, you look lost. Are you out exploring? Yep. Okay. Which way did you go? Safety numbers and all. Uh, south, south, south. South, south? Okay. Now, we probably should bring the, the blue van because it has lots of storage in it. Uh, we still have to find a sledgehammer, don't we? That's what I mean. I mean, there's lots of stuff we still... We still should probably go hit that... Um, that warehouse that, again. That warehouse again. I'm friggin' hungry. Damn it. I didn't get any food. I'm so... What's wrong? I didn't grab any food. I didn't realize I was hungry. Oh, I'm packaged too. And then you told me there was food in the fridge and everything. That was the stupid part. Ooh, fresh apples. A fresh burrito. We have six fresh burritos. I think I'll have one of those. Should I heat it up in the microwave? Five minutes. Oh, it can't be done yet. Maybe it is. Da, da, da. What's a burrito? You don't know what a burrito is. A burrito is a... Do you know what a tortilla is? <laughs> Yeah, it's a base. A tortilla is basically like a flatbread, a really thin flatbread, and then you you put uh, meat of some kind, usually uh, beef, chicken, or fish, or pork. Typically, it's uh, chicken or beef. Add cheese, lettuce, maybe some other little vegetables uh, for seasoning, that kind of stuff. And beans are also an option, an option as well. Has it got spuds in it? No, you don't see too many potatoes. Eh? Actually, you don't usually see potatoes inside a tortilla and a burrito. However, it's not unheard of. They have breakfast burritos, and usually when a breakfast burrito, they usually put, uh, they take a, 
uh, they'll take potatoes and they, they, they dice them up like into little chunks and they'll throw them in for that and they usually mix in some like scrambled eggs and that kind of stuff. That's actually not, that's the, the Americanized version of a breakfast burrito. The real breakfast burrito though, if the Mexican style is what they use, uh, chorizo. Is it chorizo? I think it's chorizo, which is basically a, 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 a sausage kind of deal. Um, kind of greasy and that kind of thing but it's really if they and they they mix that in cook it and throw an egg in there to mix it up that way it's really really good it's full of calories you would get so fat eating them and you'll have fun doing it it's the best way to get a heart attack i'm telling you stuff is awesome but that's the real breakfast burrito <laughs> it's chorizo and an egg is the real breakfast the the americanized version of the breakfast burrito they add uh, potatoes instead of the chorizo Hey, Eric, welcome back. <laughs> yeah, spicy sausage melt. Although the it, you don't always see the the breakfast the chorizo uh, burritos with uh, cheese on them too. Typically, you can. It depends on who's cooking them, but typically the way are it's just chorizo, egg, and wrap it in a burrito and in a and a tortilla, and that's it. But again, you will see cheese sometimes, but that's a little overkill. But it, it's also very good. I mean, both versions are very good. Hell, I've ha I have uh, breakfast burritos um, for dinner sometimes because some because we go to you know local Mexican places. When Mrs. Gimpy goes, you want Mexican? Sure. And what do you want? And I went, oh, let's do something different. I'll have a breakfast burrito, and it's perfectly normal. <laughs> it's perfectly normal because I basically what I do is I just eat half of it for dinner and then I eat the other half for breakfast the next day. It's great stuff. Boss fight. Tubby, did you hear that? There is a boss fight starting. I heard the squirrel is looking for you. So we're taking the blue head or the white one? The, the blue one. And hopefully it has... Uh... Uh oh. No, I switch seats. You can get okay. it. Okay. Oh, you want me to drive, huh? Just takes me a second to. Well, I drove last time, so. That's, that's okay. Vehicle mechanics, uh, turn AC on, horn. I assume you know where you're going. Yeah. How do you see how much uh, gas you have? It should be on the gauge. Oh, there's a gauge? Yeah, there's a gas gauge. Oh, down at the bottom. Oh, this like this thing is empty. Well, let's see what happens okay. when we turn. Let's we see have if we gas canisters in the crate. Maybe we can transfer some gas from the other vehicles. Yeah, let's see what happens when I turn the engine on. Oh, we're good. This thing's almost, this thing is full. Oh, okay. This thing is full. Oh, okay. If I hit map, I can actually see the little red dot moving on the map. Yep. Neat trick. Good job, Dom. Eric's Tully beating up on a cute little kitten again. That's so twice. The right hand turn. Yeah. The kitten has died twice today, Jeff. They just killed the day. They did kill it again. They just killed it again. So I'll keep going straight after this intersection. And then you're going to be making right hand turn here. Now let's write these guys. I remember these. Like and left. Oh, apparently, you can't run over the, the mailbox. No, nah, it hurts the vehicles. The spirit of fell in battle, so he didn't. Uh... And then the next right you take. Okay. It's not a blood. Yeah, you just pretty much here. follow the road to the warehouse. Okay. Okay. What's that? Uh, we just hit a trash can that I didn't realize oh. we were gonna hit. I could check. Well, let's see what we find in the warehouse. I guess. <laughs> Lots of trash cans here. There might be a lot of garbage bags. Oh, I didn't think about that. We could do that on the way back. Yeah, we'll get loaded up first. Oh, and Tully says kittens taste good in a burrito. The, ga the 
the van is full of gas. You can see the, the gas gauge in the middle of the screen at the bottom there. This. Yeah, this is it. Are you ready? Oh, it's up ahead. It's Yep, this is it. Okay. I what thought I heard heck? a gunshot. I did too. Maybe we should leave. Eh, we'll be fine. I don't know if zombies are shooting guns now. It's kind of scary. Yeah. So, let's see. There's a zombie to ourself. We got a cockroach in that. I'll take care of the zombie. Okay. Just remember to shut the door on your way in. Fire tire pump. What do you tire pump for? <laughs> Not exactly sure what we're looking for. Oh, I've been scratched. Oh, yeah, you got a bucket. Um, got a couple of zombies at the other side of the door. Do we need to kill them? Sounds I kind of suck. <laughs> okay, just a second. Let me go through these real quick. Okay, let them in. That's right. All right. Want me to let them in? That's one left. Good job. So I got a scratch on me. I'll just patch it up and you'll be fine. <laughs> Hope it takes more. Is this map is in... a tire that blew? Maybe. Hey, welcome back, Sword Do we Soul. need more watering cans? Or... Actually, you yes. Water it, I guess. Yes. Yes, you definitely want to grab the cans. Because at least, at least they can do is store water. The garage door and drive shovels? the van in. I don't think we can open the garage door. Uh, shovel. I don't know if we need shovels. There's a snow shovel. Ooh, chips. Sandbags. We gotta get the sandbags. Safety goggles. I mean, they can't spit in my face. I don't even think we can open the door, can we? Apparently we can. I kind of forgot to turn that van off, too. That was a mistake. What? And I just got bit. Need some help? Obviously, you do. Come on. That was just brilliant. Everything good? I get for listening to the crowd there. Terminal damage. I'm gonna die. I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Okay, come on. I'm dead under the van. What? I'm dead under the van. Because that zombie took a big chunk out of me. Mistake was not close to the door. The zombie dead? Yeah, the zombie's dead, but uh, so am I. I did not crawl under the van. I fell under the van when I died. Or as I was dying. 
The van is still running, by the way, and the door is open. The door to the warehouse is still open. How do I close the warehouse door? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I right-clicked on the, the outline of the door to open it, or to unlock it and then open it. Because the idea was to pull the wet van in so that we could load it safely and that kind of stuff. So anyway, new character. I will see with Jeff. He'll be fine. Oh, I can spawn right next to you. Let's do that. Okay, I'll leave your corpse alone then. It's not co it's not coming back for whatever reason, so that's good. That's fine. with the hat or Gimpy without the hat. <sighs> oh look, all my stuff. <laughs> Did you close the door? Yeah, the door's closed. Okay. Where are those? Empty bucket. A hand scythe. Okay. Oh, a hand scythe? Hand scythe? What the hell is that supposed to be? I don't know. If you got a lot of wheat, I guess. Hmm. Oh, did you pick up my... Uh... I didn't touch your corpse. Oh, where's mine? Oh, it must be laying on the ground. There's the metal pipe. I got my hat back, too. Sickle. Scythe. It's, yeah. Good for chopping heads off? You think so. Yeah, I'm going to stick with my metal bar. Nice. So I'm already overloaded. That's good. Ooh, metal pipe. Hey, a padlock. It's a padlock. Yeah, I'm not sure what you can do with that. Probably take it apart for something, maybe. Wood glue. Do we need wood glue? Yes. And duct tape. Extra hammers are always good. So far, no sledgehammer. Garden hoe. That's good for. Can you make armor? I don't think so. I don't know. Uh, the vending machine has been cleared out. Here looks like. Ah, seeds. Yes, we definitely need seeds. Yeah, I don't know if you can make armor. Here's some more seeds. Garden spray can. Cool. Yep, yep, yep. yep. Do we need more rakes or probably not? Probably not. Is that a yes or no? Oh, probably not. Probably oh, not. Okay. I don't know what we do concrete. Hey, there's safety goggles. Safety goggles over here. The screws are used for something, but I don't know what. A dust mask. <laughs> ah. Blasting powder. We need blasting powder for. 
you can find armor, but there's a mod to make it. Oh. Bucket. Club hammer, is that... I don't know if it's anything special. Nails. So much stuff. Yeah, quite a bit of stuff here. So it wouldn't be oh propane. Don't know what we're gonna do with it, but found it. Another empty bucket. Carrying a lot of stuff. Purple paint, yes, purple paint. Been upstairs yet? Yeah, I was. Anything good? Oh, okay. but then I ran. That's when you died, so I didn't really take a good look up there yet. Oh, okay. Antique oven. Yeah, hmm. I don't know what we're supposed to do with that. I think that's something that you can. You get wood, you put that in there, and then you could probably cook out of it. I would think so. That so you makes don't... sense. I would think so. Oh. Well, I think we want I think we want it. Yeah, grab it and can throw it in the, the truck. Oh, it's heavy. It's forty pounds. It's okay. The truck can carry a lot. It's not letting me grab it. Oh really? Okay. Yeah, it's not letting me grab it at all. See if you can disassemble it, maybe. The option says grab, equip primary, and creep secondary. I tried all three and it doesn't do anything. Oh. There's a zombie outside on the, to the western wall. Oh, I'll you leave it for now. Something are... to think about me. There's a thought. Making the warehouse our base of operations. Uh... Maybe for another run. The thing is, is does it have the cooking stations that we have back at the house. Well, the cooking stations will be useless soon. But they're not useless now. <laughs> That's the point. Oh, this refrigerator's got some food in it, too. Okay, I couldn't find a sledgehammer. Yeah, I don't, I don't, there's not always a sledgehammer, so not a huge deal. I hear a zombie somewhere. Yeah. Is this outside? Yes, it's exit, so we don't want to go that way. So, so I grabbed some seeds and where was, containers. Where was the oven? I know it was somewhere over here. Oh, uh, follow me. Right over here. Antique oven. Oh, there it is. So Aren't your furniture. legs getting stiff? You haven't moved in quite a while. Stretch, damn oh. it, you ignorant meat bag. Maybe we can unload a little bit because it is heavy. Could be. Or maybe we just got to get a bit stronger. Come on, door open. Going through? Yeah. Just want to cooperate. There we go. Let's 
So, so zombie front uh, towards the east. Yeah. And another one towards southwest. Yeah. Just throw as much stuff into the truck as you can so you don't have to carry it around. Okay. I guess go see if we can pick up the oven. I mean, it's heavy. I, would, I don't know. Why would they have it in there? Yep, just let me grab it now. I have it. Oh, you picked it up? Yep. Okay, I hear a zombie. Yeah, there's a zombie towards the west. I'll let you handle it. Test. On the ground. Okay. Did you hear the phone? The phone was ringing, but nobody left a message, so it couldn't have been important. You talking in game or are you talking RL? <laughs> in real life, the phone was ringing. Okay. Uh, is there anything else we need from inside? I don't think so. Other than my soul that was lost in there. Yeah, that's how it goes sometimes. Oh. There was. You didn't, I'm going to explore the, the second floor a little bit more just to make sure there's nothing useful up there because you didn't get a chance really okay. to explore. Close right? the door. Okay. So it looks like the second floor is. Oh, maybe it's not bad. It's right over here. <laughs> oh. Pens. More pens and paper. Matches. I'll definitely take matches. Oh, there's another set of stairs. Yep, mm. third floor. It's probably the roof. Yep, it's the roof. This would be a very nice place to have a base, but... Yeah. Nice... Lots of space up here on the roof, but there's nothing up here. Oh, wow. Big open space. And dead end. It does need a patio set, yes. Definitely needs a patio set. Okay. I think we got all the good stuff out of here. I think. I mean, there's still a lot of tools and stuff here, but we don't need them right now. You can always come back if we have to. Yeah, when stuff breaks, you can come back for it, I guess. Too bad we can't grab the radio. It has the emergency station on it. <laughs> then we can listen to the weather and stuff. Somehow I don't think people are talking about the weather too much. Oh, no, no. It's supposedly like on the emergency. There's, You have to find the radio with the emergency broadcast station. Oh, okay. And then it tells you the weather and other stuff. Other important things. Oh, 
one's bucket in there. Missed that one. Okay. Okay, man. Engine doesn't always cooperate. Okay, so I guess we're going back. Unless you want to explore a little bit more. Oh, I forgot to look at the garbage can for the garbage bag. Yeah, I already did. There's a cockroach in it. That's it. All right. Let's actually. So every time we stop by a garbage can, then I'll jump out and take a look in it. Driving it's backwards over. Oh shit, it's nighttime. Um Told you it was nighttime. <laughs> you told me this was LA Noir, but it's not. I'm trying to want look around and see what we're passing. See if there's anything useful. Yeah, there's a garbage can here. Let me know when you stopped. Okay, stop. And the zombie just came over the fence. It's right in front of us. I think oh. I'm back in. Nope, I'm not. <laughs> you are? There's more garbage cans here. I'll take a look at them. I'll take care of the zombie first. There's multiple zombies running around. I don't know where you are, though. Oh, shit. Okay, there's a trash can on the other side the street too. Should I turn the headlights on? No. No. Okay, I'm back in. Okay. Hey, I actually hear the door that time. Yep, now I know. There's a garbage can coming yep. up. A couple of them. Keep going a little further. Yep. Okay, I'll okay. jump out here. Stopped. Oh, there's another uh, van down there to the south of us. It's probably we don't have a hot wire room. a zombie. You okay? Okay, I'm in. Okay. Sometimes it's hard to get in. Ah, oh, I didn't kill him. That's disappointing. Okay, we've got a zombie coming up the street. There's a trash can to our right. The keys are in the other van. It might be. Okay, man. Hello, oh. everyone. My name is Veronica, and welcome to Gimpy's Twitch channel. If you are enjoying what you are watching, please click the follow button in the lower right corner of the video screen. Think there's a trash can here. That way, you will be notified by Twitch when Gimpy back goes up a bit. live. Oh. Okay. You can also follow Gimpy over on Twitter at Gimpy Me. He tweets out there when he goes live and will more than likely follow you back. Thank you for watching. Yep, they're watching. Happy Friday. <laughs> okay, I'm back in. We're looking for trash bags so we can collect water. Have you found any? Yep, I got about at least five so far. Quite a bit. Oh, cool. Pretty much every one. Oh, okay. Well, it's works. a good thing that uh, everybody died on garbage day. 
Yeah. Come in. Another one here. <laughs> I don't know how well that's going to work. But there's. Sounds upset. Nothing in this one. Okay. Oops. I do not think oops means what you think it means. She was annoying me. I don't see any trash can here. I don't see anything. Oh, good radio stations. Oh, I didn't even think about it. Need some tunes. Which channel should we listen to? And then our radio? I don't know. If they had like classic rock, would be good. Well, supposedly there's a. Signal, well, signal's not there. it. That was our turn. Yeah, you went past. This is it. You put a sign out front. Turn here. I could dump all the bodies there. Yeah. yeah actually, it's not a horrible idea. I'll grab the corpses and I'll put it in the corner. Once the sun's back up. So I got 11 garbage bags. That'll work. So we got three in the house, I think. That's good enough? That's, That's good, good enough. enough. Okay. Uh, lights off. Engine off. And all I get to do is transfer over and get out. Should be good. Oh, we got all our stuff in the back. I'll grab it tomorrow. We should be able to get it from inside the base or inside the fence. It's so dark. It is very dark. Good thing the sheets are white. Okay, so stuff. Buckets. I'll try to grab food. Something going bump in the night? Yeah, that would be me ramming into the fence. I wonder what's in these lunch bags. Lunch boxes, are they containers? They are containers. Secondary. There is food in the lunch boxes. <laughs> oh, you grabbed the lunch boxes? Yeah, there's lunch boxes in the refrigerator back in the warehouse. So I figured I, I, know, might, I, I might, as well, might as well grab them, see if there's actually anything in there. 
There was. Shocking. Boss fight. Tubby, did you hear that? There is a Round boss three. fight starting. I heard the squirrel is looking for you. sure what we're going to do with lunch boxes, but they are containers. Not very big containers, but they're containers. Hungry, discomfort, extremely heavy load. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, got tomato seeds. Tomato seeds. Good job, Tully, Eric's, and Down for killing uh, Empire Zealot. Good job, I guess. in the refrigerator, right? Dirty clothes, because why not? So metal pipe. Eh, extra one. the seeds oh um in the corner right there at the corner uh, okay see yeah that's where i keep all the gardening stuff we have a seed bag now i put the seeds in the seed bag oh i didn't i didn't know that was even a thing How was i that? didn't either oh miss kinky's home so quiet have enough nails and screws for a while yeah they should last for a little while maybe maybe this package discomfort something doesn't feel right i didn't get bit so it's just because i'm not comfortable i'll try what are my skills looking like oh my carpentry sucks uh carpentry is down to one Oh my skill! That's right, I died again. Carpenter sucks. <sighs> Dying is horrible. It's so dark. Oh, I'm hungry. So what's still uh, lots of stuff in the truck still. That oh the 
oven. So I wonder what we're going to be able to do with this oven. Pardon me? The antique oven that we picked up. I wonder what that we're going to be able to do with that. Yeah, probably just best to put it somewhere just at the side of the house. Yeah. Probably not best to use it in the house. Probably a good way to kill us ourselves. Shh. Come so, on. So I'm Unless we can get a sledgehammer. Get and, back in there or maybe if you can stick the pipe at the, the window or something. Place the item. Yeah, it might work in the house. Who knows? I would think it would. Yeah, it's a it's an actual oven. It looks like hmm. I guess we could try. It's only carbon monoxide poison, it's not that big of a deal. Put it right in at the window. Apparently it takes a little bit of time to install it. Let's see if this is working. So apparently you need a carpentry to do this, along with a either a ball peen hammer, a hammer, or a stone hammer. Which apparently oh, there it is. So Uh, okay, safe house, we're good. Fireplace info. It has no fuel in it. So I'm guessing we have to throw food or wood into it. Let's see. So I guess this is a good time to experiment, see how it does it. So I'm sure we're going to need some sticks or something, I would think. Sticks on the ground. Planks on the ground. Twigs. Tree branches. We have all those. Oh, uh, would you put the trash? Trash. Oh, I can't build it anyway. Never mind. I was going to say we put the trash bags, but I need carpentry for. It's the, the middle one upstairs by the VHS tapes. They're all full, so now we got stuff all over the place. Some organization some organizing might need to be done. All the boxes upstairs are full? Uh, I think the middle one, there's still some space, but they're pretty much all full. Okay. Yeah, I can't build. Let me build the crates. I don't know. Find out. Anyway, there's some twigs in here. Among the tree branches, too. Add fuel. There we go. Okay, so um, the fireplace, you throw some twigs and sticks in there, and all you have to do is light it. We have matches. We have lighters, too. Just have to find them. I have matches on me. Okay, let's see if uh, you can light it then, just to see if we can, to see what happens. You just have to right click on it and it should be an option, I would think. Looks 
Okay, I think I got it. Fuel, 50 minutes of burning. Got any food? <laughs> I just made stir fry. I can make something else. One yeah. sec. Might as well take advantage of the fuel burning. Cooking pot with water. No, no, no. Oh, no, no, that's our water collection stuff. There it is, roasting pan. Very minor damage. Boil the water to clean it. Right. Well, the water in the, the pots is already clean because I boiled it already. That's why it's in the storage area here. All I have to do is find all the buckets. That we picked up. Yep, it's cooking. Cool. So, it's a plastic, plastic bag. So what can I make with these planks, I guess, is the question. As a newbie uh, carpenter, I where I can actually make. Storage boxes, that's the general idea. Hopefully I can do that. Crate. I need carpentry three in order to make crates. Yep, I can't do much right now. <laughs> I can't make a whole lot. I can make some flooring, I can make a wooden sign, and I can do a wooden cross. Not real s helpful stuff. Oh, I can start reading. Oh, it's 8 o'clock in the morning again. Anyway, for the stove, all you need to do, all you need is sticks and branches, and you just throw them in there as fuel and light them on fire, and then so we're set. So we don't really need to do that right now, but at least we have a uh, there's Jeff working out, showing off. Well, we got to wait for the to cook, so this will do something. Are you wearing a backpack? You didn't look like you were. You take it off when you work out. Ah. What am I carrying around with something? Oh, blank. so heavy anymore. So when's our stuff going to be grown? It's taking forever. How long does it take to grow? It's that time again. Drink some water to keep that brain moist. Oh, looks like we have tomato seeds too. We should probably get those going. You can never have enough food. Hey, Vanna. Look back. Happy Friday. So, tomato seeds. Seed bag. So, 
Huh? So it's just a container for holding seeds and stuff, right? Pretty much. which is good. Okay. Go do some Mr. Gardening, I guess. Plant some tomatoes. Yeah, no boss fight quite yet. Oh, I didn't. So we have five buckets. Yep. So I just set them up outside and they collect yep. water? Pretty much. Well, they're good for right now. And of course it stops raining as soon as I'm done. Or ready to start planting. Planting. So this is going to be our tomatoes. Tomatoes should go relatively quickly, right? Have you done any farming yet? No. Do you know how to do it? Nope. <laughs> okay. The quick version is you need to get a, you have to dig, the, you have to furrow into the ground first and you need a hand fork or something that's similar to that, you know, for gardening type stuff, a gardening tool. Right. You use that and that happens. And then you throw, you take your seeds, right click and tell them what kind of seeds you want to put on. And then once that's done, like you can see all the little spikes up or the whatever those things are, those sticks. And then once that's done, then you have to start adding the water. Ah. And in which case you need your uh you water know, cans upstairs. Yep. Gardening well, actually I there was a one or two of them downstairs, so I grabbed one of both of those. So I'm filling them with uh, the rain water. Okay. You have to equip them, I guess. Uh, actually, you don't. You just right-click on the, the water container and tell it to fill what container you want to fill. Make sure you don't fill your drinking water bottles, because that would be bad <laughs> with the bad water. And then you right-click on the the farming plot, select water, and then choose where you want to take the water from. In this case, we're going to use a spray can. And we'll do 40 of okay. that. And then you basically, if you once you do that and you put your cursor over the plots, they'll show up as green, and then you look at the water levels, and they'll start off as parched, and as you add the water, they will start filling up and getting not so parched, and just wait until they have enough water, and that's all you really need to do. Exciting stuff. It is. It's typical farming stuff. Makes you feel really good about yourself, that you know how to do it in a video game. Does that come from a store? Not these days. Not these days. So now we'll go back up here and fill. Oh, screw that up. <sighs> and again, you can use any water container, too. You don't have to use the watering cans. You can just use regular water bottles. They work just as good. It's just that uh, they are uh, 
not as big, so it takes more, you know, more emptying of the bottles. And the rain helps, of course. Thirsty. So many thirsty plants. That again, I guess where that switched on me. water gets from uh, rain. We're set. I just noticed the buckets on the ground. <laughs> yeah, I dumped it there. No, no, that's fine. They're filling up, so that's good. Uh, I need to work on my uh, carpentry. So oh, I need to go read is really what it is. Because I think we have beginning carpentry that will help. Takes a while for uh, plants to grow for some reason. Anymore. I'll start move some carps corpses to the middle of the road. <laughs> okay. Just sounds so messed up, doesn't it? And those of you wondering what rock or not rocket Jeff is talking about is uh we can put corpses in the middle of the road so we know where to turn when we're out driving around.
next fucking farm. Check the Bantai. Okay, good for now. Okay, so hammer. Oh, our crates on the bottom floor. They they're mm -hmm. they're pretty empty still. So most uh, three out of the four of them are fairly empty. Not even fifty percent. So. So we're good on storage for a while. But still need something to work on. Because again, I created, uh, took the wrong gimpy. I made the wrong gimpy. I took the maintenance gimpy instead of the carpenter one. So it's carp he's got carpentry, but just not as high. Starts at one instead of three, but he's got maintenance instead. I don't know what maintenance actually does. Ooh, maple syrup. Uh oh. Peanut butter. Honey. <laughs> Where'd you find that stuff? Uh, trailer home, just close by. Okay. It's carpentry. It's not me cooking for beginners. Okay, Mr. TV. What's on Mr. TV? Um, nothing, apparently. Gabby's first steps. You're all watching Woodcraft. Go us. Okay, so Kim's gonna double dip. Ah, carpentry already went up. That was quick. not do anything for me. So, farming. Wow, the carpentry's are up to three, watching this VCH, VHS type. That's quick. 
that was real quick. Went up two levels really fast. And it's already done. Okay, I have to watch episode two of that. Let's see what that does for us. We're watching Woodcraft. One stop shop for home improvement. We're st starting with the basics. The kind of stuff they teach at Kittengarten. That's not a something. You like floors? I like floors. Take a plank and a nail like this. Put the nail through your hand. Take your hammer and bang, bang. Looks kind of nice like that, huh? Bang, bang. You know what else looks is good for practice? A sign. Write whatever you like. Hunk at work, maybe. Bang, bang. Like the, that, ladies, leave me all straight to me. Oh, God, this guy's a moron. Tomorrow we're taking off the, the training wheels. Door frames, here we come. Yep. Woodcraft. Oh, there's a song and everything. You know what they say? Of the women, if they don't find you handsome, at least they'll find you handy. <laughs> Never heard that before, but okay. <laughs> Never watched the Red Green Show? Or no. That's a Canadian thing. Yeah, it's a Canadian thing. And yes, Tully, VHS, this game is actually supposed to be taking place back in like the 80s or 90s. So that's why there's VHS still around. This show is real special. It's for the ladies. In my experience, ladies love stairs. They're smiling when they go up them. Uh-oh. And they're smiling more when they come back down. Wow. Yeah, so carpentry is up to four. Eight planks, eight nails, and stuff, stuff, stuff. Boss fight. Tully, did you hear that? There is a boss fight starting. That's right. I said Tully. Unlike Gimpy, I know the difference between Tubby and Tully. She's talking to you, Tully. Oh, carpentry's up to four. That's quick. So, if you want to get your carpentry up, if you get don't have any yet, these VH, the three VH to H, three v, VHS tapes. Low. Yeah, if you watch these, uh, this this is level one. Yeah. So. Speed yep, yep. If you watch these three tapes, it should get you up to at least three. Oh, wow. Because they got me from one to four. I have four and almost four and a half. So I'll, I'll put them back into a little bookcase back here. So where are they? Them. They're in the book ca bookcase underneath the light switch by the door. And you want the Woodcraft episodes one, two, and seven. Okay. Oh, let me get to... Uh, Building some water collection stuff or crates or whatever. What did you say the bags were? <laughs> I forgot. Which bags? Oh, the uh, bags. middle one upstairs, I think. Yep, there are 11 of them. So these VH VHS tapes are actually kind of nice for learning. Oh, there's seven episodes. We only have three of them. Yep. Hey, Gimpy, have you hydrated lately? If not, you really should. Good job, Bad, a Disparator and Down for beating up on a squirrel. Poor squirrel. What did the squirrel do to you? Poor, poor squirrel. Now we just need CDs of teaching stuff, and you can watch a VHS tape, read a book, and listen to a CD all at the same time. Yep. I wonder if you have like more than one TV. If you put it like them in a row, 
you put different VHS tapes in each of them, and you just can you watch them all at the same time? Well, why not? I don't see why. I mean, you can be reading a book and watching the VHS and learning at the same time. We need more TVs upstairs. Then. Uh, I think there's one across the street to the south of us. I haven't figured out how to grab it yet. Oh. Um, I think I already moved it once, so I'll go grab it. After I get some... Uh, what was I going to do? Where are the nails? Perhaps planks. So, carpentering. Barrel. So this must be a bigger one. Stockpile supplies before the water. Yes. So rain collector barrel. That one over here. Of water, so I'll grab that cooking pot of water. Let's put a few of them in here. What we're going to do is going to take these and we're going to fill up this, add water from that stuff. Just to watch the tapes up there. Yep. So I built a uh, water collection thing down on the first floor. And it takes quite a bit of water to fill it, it looks like. No, oh, maybe not. So that's fine. I need one plank. One of those. Actually, I can build two more, so I need four more planks. When you're watching a tape, can you read a book at the same time? Or Yes. Okay. Yeah, I, I found that one. I was, uh, what was it last week? Yeah, last week um, I was reading books and somebody else was watching TV stuff too, and I was picking up both things. So, huh? It's still at twenty-five, so it didn't change anything for me. What didn't change? I'm still at level one. Oh, really? Huh. I wonder why I jumped up so much. Oh, maybe because I'm a quick learner. Maybe that's what it is. Um... 
Mr. Bucket. Drop the bucket. A lady can keep her valuables in it. Maybe a Bible. Maybe a gun. Pots with water. Let's finish my water. Fill it. Fill my water bottles first. How's this thing still on? I don't think this is. Oh, it's... oh, it's on lit. Okay, no big deal. We don't need it to be lit. Because. Ah, cooking pots, go into the oven. So what I'm doing is um, boiling the water because it's currently tainted because it's rainwater. So you have to boil it. And then once it's all boiled off or boiled up, whatever, um, we're going to throw it over into our water storage over here. And this will be clean water, right? Yep. So clean water. So it's a bit of a process, but uh, it's working, I guess. Still need more trash bags, but I have to go out and collect them wherever we can find them. What? We're through all the garbage bags already? Yep. It, it's four each, and so what I did is I built, uh, well, I already had a couple, I think I had three, three bags. So along with yours, it was enough to build three storage containers. And they're down here at the bottom of the stairs now, and I'm just trying to fill them up with the regular water now. And that looks clean. Because we have four cooking pots, so food get or the water. Ah, uh, so you're just using these ones down here for to hold the water, I guess. Yep, fresh water. Or clean water. Oh, okay. So you're saying we got to make another trip for more bags? Oh, yeah. We're always going to need more bags. <laughs> well, I guess it depends how much storage we need. Because there actually is a bigger storage container. But I don't have access to it yet because it's... Uh, um, um, what is it? Uh, Carpentry 7 or something like that. Oh, look, there's a muffin. I eat the muffin. I'm eating all the crappy stuff. Oh, there's stir fry in here that's still. Half of that. Apparently, I haven't been eating lately because I'm really, really hungry. But I'm good now. It's fall. Okay, cooking pots with water, all four of them. So, add water from. So there's only 25 water in the cooking pot, or the whatever it is. Cooking pots, yeah, 25 water in there, and these things hold. I 
I gotta guess they, these things hold at least a hundred water. More. Hmm, I thought I had four cooking pots. So I only have three. It for that. Hmm. Okay, well, I had four pots. Hey, Marcus. Going to be a Friday thing? Uh, for a little while, maybe. We'll see. I mean, it's going so far. It's fun. I'm having fun doing it, so. And Jeff's here to join me this week. Kreese may or may not be here. I don't know. Depends on, you know, work for him, so. Again, if anybody has a game and wants to join us, you're more than free. Just make sure uh, we're friends on Steam and not a problem. Get you in as soon as we can. Really easy to do. Can't make the window any better, bigger, can I? I'll make this. This is it's tainted. Yeah. Oh, I can actually see the plants coming up finally. Those are the potatoes, I think. They're growing slightly different because they're all planted at different times for the most part. Okay, now we got to boil the water again and we just put in the water into storage because we never know when the water is going to go out and we don't know when the power is going out either. But now we have a stove that we can use the wood to burn. It's a wood stove, so it shouldn't be too much of an issue. So as long as it keeps raining, <laughs> as long as it keeps raining, which it should, um, and we have wood, we can clean the water and drink it. So, right? And we have matches. Right. It's a, how do you, I wonder how many, the matches run out though? That I've never, uh, one sec. I would think they would. And lighters. I know there's a lighter floating around too somewhere. Yeah, there's there. a, a bar for the matches. Okay, I imagine so the right lighters. Right now, mine is uh, probably about four fifths, so quite a bit left. Okay. 
but we got to learn how to make fire. <laughs> There's got to be a way to make fire, right? But without matches and yeah, yeah you would think so. It's got to be a way. It's got to be in our survival or something. Yeah, if you get one of those survival kits, um, a sparker or whatever those things are called, that'd be useful. Survivalist. This is... Yeah, worst comes to worst, we got the propane. Yeah, but even propane, you need to be able to light it. Make a camp campfire kit. That's for making a campfire, though. I wonder how that works. Two logs, some sheets. Make a steak, stone axe, tent kit. no mention of how to make fire. You can make a tinfoil hat. That's funny. Light a candle. I need a lighter matches. Oh, you need me to start the fire? Well, there's a one of the things in our general crafting is lighting a candle. <laughs> All you need is a candle and a lighter or matches to, for it to happen. But I'm looking to see if there's any mention of how to just make fire. I haven't seen a survival kit. I mean, the only real option you have would be to just keep a fire going all the time. I did have a fork cooking pot. Census three. Oh, there it is. So apparently you just didn't make it into the stove before. Okay, yeah, the trick is going to be keeping fire going, which I think was a, a thing back in the day, wasn't it? You had to keep a fire going all the time? Yeah, it's a good job for the kids and the wife. <laughs> in the olden days. In the olden days, yes. Or when you're trying to survive the the zombie uh, apocalypse. Like if you have like a schoolhouse or something, that'd be one of the tasks for the older kids. Yeah. Not something we need to worry about right at the moment. Exciting stuff, though, isn't it? Which yes. we go look. Which what do we need? I guess is the question. We need a sledgehammer. Sledgehammer would be nice to find, but where do we go find one? Is the real question. No idea. Hello, Gimpy. It is time to take a break. It's break time again. Go check on the dogs. Jeff is prepared for Your the next zombie break. Horde. Is in two hours. He might be. Huh? He might be. Tully is saying you sound like you're ready for the zombie horde. Do you talk about like in game or RL? <laughs> Sounds like real life, probably. <laughs> what <are> my guess? <laughs> uh, where I'm at. I don't have a sledgehammer here. I'll give you that. <laughs> he doesn't have a sledgehammer in real life, Tully, so I don't think he's going to make it. Okay, I'm going to read a book while I am on break. So, sorry, 
Okay, I'm going to get up real quick, stretch my legs, get some water, that kind of thing. Talk to Mrs. Skippy real quick. We'll see what dinner deal is like, and I'll be back in a few minutes. So thank you all very much. Thank you all very much for watching, and enjoy the dog video.